Dr. Sella here. We're on day 81 of the 366 days of sports psychology. Today we're going to discuss overcoming failure. It's real simple, coaches. People overcome failure when they realize that it's in their best interest to do so. They have to come to the realization that it's in their best interest to overcome failure. They have to draw that conclusion. All the motivational quotes on Twitter probably aren't going to do you much good. Because right now, all your motivational quotes about effort and investment on Twitter, all it does is blend into the furniture and blend into the background. It doesn't do much. It's basically your passion to do things the right way the first time and to actually go on and do it. That's what's going to do the best job of convincing your people to overcome failure, but really a lot of it is <sighs> what you can control is how you approach it. First of all, if you're needy to win, you've already lost because needy men don't survive in this country. They don't because needy men are betas. And it doesn't matter what angle you're working on, whether it's business, coaching, or getting women. If you're needy, you're losing. Needy people teach a process and surrender the outcome to God. And that's it. And they shall not move on their process. So, people overcome failure when they realize it's in their best interest to do so. Teach your process, surrender the outcome. That's your best shot at convincing your people it's in their best interest to overcome failure. Period. Coaches, if you're looking to create elite performance strategies designed to enhance your team's 2020 performance, give me a call. 570-332-0265. 570-332-0265. With the Sports Psychology for Football Academy, you are going to learn the techniques that will make your people more effective. So give me a call and I'll see you tomorrow for Day 82. We will talk then.